Happy Easter to those who celebrate Easter in a gorgeous Sunday. To everybody else who doesn't, I uh, hope you're all doing well. As I know it's been a while since I've done videos. I've been quite busy with a lot of stuff with the Around the Cabin thing going on. Of course, you can always find us at aroundthecabin.com and uh, go check us out over there. Some really cool stuff has come down the path lately. We've got uh, some wonderful bone and antler and uh, glass arrow tips and bone arrow tips and other things from our good friend Mike Parker. And Mike Parker is going to be doing a show with us uh, starting next month. So be watching for his show. It's going to be really cool stuff. He does a lot of native kind of things. Mike is part Indian, and he does uh, some really cool arrows and bows and does a lot of stuff he makes himself, does flint napping and glass napping and all kinds of stuff. And then he also teaches a more primitive, traditional way of doing things. He believes in getting back to the land and finding his native roots. And my hat's off to you, Mike. Wonderful guy. Wonderful guy, very knowledgeable man. We're lucky to have him with us. And he's a big part of Around the Cabin, always there to support everybody else. He decided he'd like to do a show, so yeah, right in there. I also want to thank, uh, take this moment to thank GregMcGeeEngineering.com. Now, Greg McGee sent me a flashlight to be reviewed. I'm not going to do a review on this flashlight yet, but I am going to show it to you guys. This flashlight is actually going to go down to the Ohio Tri-State, Ohio, Indiana, Kentucky, the largest forensic lab in the area my wife goes to school at. And uh, a lot of police chiefs and other people down there that she knows, a lot of people that we're involved with. And they're going to review this flashlight themselves and then let me know what they think about it. Uh, this flashlight is not a flashlight that you would go into the store and pick up. This flashlight is a specialty flashlight. And it is a little more expensive, but there is a reason for that and the uses for that. So this is the flashlight in question. I'm going to show this to you. It has a hardened glass lens, which is a little more expensive, but also has the self-defense front end on the flashlight. It is a very small flashlight, fits in your hand. It has the button on the back for on, off, and a multitude of settings, including the disorientation light, or as my friend Big Dirt likes to say, the, the puke light. Okay, that goes on. I'm not going to turn it on because it'll blind you. It's like 1,200 luminous. It's, it's amazing. It makes my mag light look dim. Okay, so. Uh, with all that stuff, it is just, it's just awesome, and there's a, a lot more that goes with it. If you'd like to find out what this flashlight is, you can go to gregmcgeeengineering.com, gregmcgeeengineering.com, and this is the enforcer version of what he's got there. And uh, I'll go into that later. Yes, it's a little more expensive, but uh, sometimes you have to pay uh, for what you need for around the house. Uh, so we got this here. Uh, battery chargers, batteries, everything else that goes with it all came with it. I want to thank Greg for that. Mike Parker sent us some great stuff, as I said. We've got that there. That's going on. Conflicted the card game. We're going to be giving some cards away here in the next couple of weeks. So you want to be there on the website for the card game. Hello to everybody I've missed lately. Hello for not doing uh, videos. I'm sorry about that. I'm glad you guys liked the uh, glove video where I stuck my hand in the water. See, my hands are fine. My hands are fine. Uh, I want to tell you guys to drop by and see all my friends, the Canning Diva, and Greg McGee, uh, Mike Parker. Check out Brandon Burroughs. Brandon's back home. He's working on shooting a bow with his mouth because of his arm, and we're talking about possibly training him to shoot left-handed, depending on if we can get a brace on that right arm for him and what's going on. There's a lot of different options open for people. Right now we have a huge contest running at around a cabin for uh, a one-handed fire starting. So you need to check that out. One-handed fire starting, submit your entries to aroundacabin at gmail.com. You must submit a video and be in the room to win. We're going to be giving away some good stuff, so all that's going on. Other than that, planes flying overhead. My hawks are still nesting this year up here, and everything's going great. The yard looks good. Everybody's in decent health around here. I hope you guys are, too. Many blessings to you all, and we'll see you all later. Everybody have a good one.